Hello friends, welcome to FIRES. My name is Samrat Chaudhary and I welcome you for this fourth episode of web series of FIRES and Trading View Integration. Friends, in today's session, we are going to talk about charts, the indicators, the drawing tools, various templates, alert systems, and the bar replay model of TradingView. I am sure by now you have already created an account with TradingView. If you have still not done, then kindly click on the link given in the description below and create an account with TradingView along with a trading account with FIRES. You can see my episode 1 on readiness, episode 2 on installation and episode 3 in which I covered the FIRES API bridge for more details. So friends, uh, straight away coming to the TradingView platform. This is my login in the TradingView platform and uh, I have taken a pro subscription. Uh, you have to just log into this page in .tradingview.com. As you log in, you will be seeing various things, ideas, markets, scripts, screeners, brokers, charts, and many more, right? So what you are supposed to do over here is just click on the charts option. The moment you click on chart, it will load a default template, the default setting that you have. I have actually logged in into this account a number of times. That's why whatever you are seeing might not be the default view for you. Uh, but the purpose over here is to show you how the trading view platform looks like and how you can actually play with it. So inside this uh, platform, there are various sections and the moment you see uh, those sections, so say for example, I am seeing Nifty and maybe say for example, I'm seeing it in 15 minutes. This is the time period. So this space on the top that you are seeing over here is where you type in the name of the script. At times you don't have to even go there and click. What you can do simply is just type. Okay. I see I have not clicked it anywhere. I'm just typing. Say for example, Bank Nifty. I'm just typing Bank Nifty after I have landed into this page. It will take me to this kind of a window which will open by default. And as it opens, I have to just click on the script that is suitable for me and I will be able to see it. Right. You all, you all are aware that this is a time period. So this is 15 minutes and you can get various time periods like 1 minute, 3 minute, 5 minute, 15 minutes. Again, you need not go there and type simply. For example, if you want to see it in 30 minutes time frame, just type 30 using your keyboard. And on the chart itself, it will show like this 30. And the moment you hit enter, it will reflect on your platform. So these are some of the keyboard shortcuts. And in this session, what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about some very, very frequently used tools that most traders uses, right? So um, uh, now see there are various sections. The top section over here that you are seeing on the top left hand corner, this is typically the section where you uh, put in the name of the stock and uh, the time frame, the candlestick patterns, which pattern you want. You want to see it in Heiken Ashi candle or a normal candle. That's something that you uh, mention over here. Uh, you can compare scripts that is if you are I'm sure if you're using fires uh, platform there also we have seen several times that we can compare scripts this is for that comparison this is the indicators list okay so the moment you click on this FX you will be able to see various indicators that you may uh, be using on a day in day out basis say for example I need an indicator named relative strength index RSI I'm just typing it and after typing it you will be able to see two things over here see there will be certain things called built-ins built-ins means these are the indicators which are built in which are default indicators along with that there is going to be several public library also so, so this is a very good social trading platform trading view is a social trading platform because here you will be able to see various kinds of indicators various kinds of strategies custom made templates that a user may have created and you can access everything that you want so you have to distinguish between the two you have to understand which indicator you're using there can be an indicator with the same name here also but you have to understand what exactly you want so say for example built in is relative strength index just click on this and this will get plotted on your chart very simple that's how you always do if this is your favorite you can just click on the um, there is a small star beside that you just click on that it will come into your favorite list now say for example if this is a strategy that you are using in which you are seeing bank nifty in maybe 
uh, 15 minutes time frame with a relative strength index and definitely I'm sure you are aware how you can edit the fields over here still I'm showing you like say for example you are want to see it in a time frame of 80 20 as a over bought and oversold zone and maybe a length of maybe two periods okay now this can be your setup now if this is your setup in a Heiken Ashi candle and you want to save it save this template what you have to do is just click on this option over here okay which says indicator templates click on it click on the save indicator template option just name it I'm just naming it as BNF underscore RSI underscore HA whatever this is what for example I'm just naming it and I'm saving the time interval you have to understand if you are clicking on the save time interval save interval it will be saving this template in 15 minutes time frame otherwise it is going to save it in a it will I mean it can load it in a very default kind of a time frame so this is how the top section is this is where you are supposed to do this definitely there is one thing which is called an alert I will definitely tell you what an alert is and how it works but for that right now it is not the, the market is off it's not the market hour right now hence what I will do is I will take you to uh, BTC because BTC market is something that keeps on running 24x7 every day so hence over here in the crypto market I can probably take this option BTC USD just to show you how this works in the real time right so whatever chart you are seeing over here maybe I can reduce the time frame to one minute so that it becomes easy for you to capture some alerts during the process of this presentation so you are seeing that there is um, the bar the candle is getting formed it's forming up and down and there is definitely an RSI which is moving because it's a live market over here now I'll cover how to create an alert option because by the time I show you how to create an alert and by the time I am explaining you other features on the left hand side maybe a possibility is there that you will be getting a trade a live trade to see so alert is a very very important fun functionality over here and which helps you you know like say for example you are using this platform you are making your own algo or you are maybe you know seeing the chart you can create your alert and do your other work the moment it appears it will give you an give you a pop-up and that becomes very very helpful now say for example this is RSI 2 that I am using and the default value over here is whatever it is I named it uh, marked it as 80 and 20 if my strategy says that the moment my price um, this RSI value will cross 80 and come down I'm going to take a shot okay assume let's assume that this is a strategy okay now how will I be able to create an alert for that I have to just click on this button over here which is the alert button and then I have to write the condition over here what is my condition my condition is my RSI 2 that I have just plotted should be crossing down this is crossing down the value of 85 80 okay so the moment that happens only once you can say only once once per bar once per minute whatever so for the sake of this presentation I'm keeping it as only once so the moment this happens you will get a signal for a short okay see here you can customize this message again relative strength index to crossing down this one this and all so I maybe I'm editing it time to short perfect I'm just creating it so the moment you create an alert like that what happens is if you click over here you can see on the top right hand corner this is the alert window you have seen that one alert has come so I may I'm taking a short basis this similarly I can take a buy also uh, basically a long trade also the moment when the RSI may cross this line of 20 so I can again create one more alert in a similar manner say for example my RSI 2 is crossing up the value of 20 whenever this is going to happen during the day I'm going to take a long right take a long trade okay see by the time I'm typing all this this thing happened this is exactly what I wanted to show you this this thing happened this came down and um, a pop-up has also appeared okay while I was typing it came that's why you may have missed that pop-up don't worry uh, we will again see one more and um, um, the crux of the story is that whenever you're creating this kind of an alert you will be seeing a slight line over here see this is a dotted line the orange color dotted line that will come which will help you uh, get the real-time alert at the real time 
fine so let's see uh, let's see or maybe what i can do is i will wait for a while to see if a new alert is coming and while we are waiting to see an alert that is coming in real time what we will do is i will try to um, take you to the drawing tools which is there on the top left hand side okay on the sorry on the left hand side bar so there are few common uh, very common kind of tools that you we use on a day in day out basis and which are very very hand, uh, very very helpful so say for example info line this info line is a very essential tool say for example you want to see that from here till here what is that point of move, points movement it has done you can just click on that top uh, the top of that uh, candle and the bottom of this candle and you will be able to drag that line okay um, i'm sure you all are very very friendly with the platform that fires uses and in the fires platform there is a very interesting feature which is the magnet tool okay so this is a strong magnet and weak magnet that is something like that so you can create this magnet you know the moment you click on this magnet what happens is if you are taking your cursor over here and clicking over here okay automatically it will pick up the price automatically you can pick up the nearest bar value which is uh, nearby to it so it becomes very very helpful for you when you are using it if you are not using it what happens is say for example i'm clicking here i will be able to click here right so this becomes a very essential tool i recommend whenever you will be using this platform from for an analysis perspective you should be using this kind of tools um in the meanwhile let's see what's happening over here the price over here is above 92 so let me maybe create one more alert so this this is the alert on short that we had created but we had created it for only one occurrence i can edit this as well i can again edit it and save it see the moment i did that this line is appearing over here once again so the moment the price will cut rsi 80 downwards it will trigger for a short not trigger i mean it will give me an alert for a short and similarly when it will cut from down to upwards above 25 it will definitely call for a buy let's wait and see so now uh, coming to the other tools uh, there are see various sections over here okay you have to just explore and see this are the line kind of a thing and see as we are speaking we see a short that had already happened so this is how the alert works right so this is exactly what happens when you create an alert see for example you are not in front of the system uh, you are in some office calls or something and the alert pops up you will not miss the trade that's the beauty of this tool okay um, coming back to this section which is which is your patterns so see there are various tools again i will be talking to you on some important features like fibonacci repress repressment or trend based uh, fibonacci extensions which are most frequently used say for example <coughs> you have identified the uh, swing high and probably this is your swing low and you want to connect so just click on this click on this and you connect it uh, maybe if you are doing an analysis and you are seeing into the chart from an analysis purpose you may require to see um you know like at times we write on the chart and this tool over here that you are seeing tv you can use this uh, you can use a balloon you can use a call out anything so say for example you are writing this as swing high okay swing high so i am writing it as a swing high and i am just keeping it here so that in future whenever i will be seeing this chart and whenever i will be analyzing uh, by looking into this chart i will be able to do it so these are some of the features that you can explore definitely some of the interesting features are like this kind of things where you can draw rectangles or you can do your analysis in various uh, methods uh, in addition to this let me just delete all these things in addition to this uh, what you also know can do is there are i'm sure you are aware of this there are various kind of patterns and all so you can just draw those patterns on that and <clears throat> you should be in a position to uh, understand how the things works right so that's about the uh, tools on the left hand side did i miss out anything uh, no yeah so this is one more interesting tool you know many a times what we do is as per the strategy we have a risk to reward ratio for the um, you know for the for whatever trade we take so this can work like a beautiful thing say for example you are taking a long trade over here okay and your target is somewhere around maybe here okay i should remove this so that 
I can play with it, right? So the moment you are doing this, just look at the middle section of this um, of this window. Risk to reward ratio 1.99. Okay, so over here, the moment you do this, you draw this tool, you will be in a position to get your desired risk to reward ratio price. Okay, friends. So now let's come to the last part of this presentation, which is uh, regarding the bar replay. Uh, on the top pan over here, you can see this uh, bar replay button, uh, two arrows facing towards backwards. Now this is a very very essential tool which gives us um, for free in trading view. This helps us in you know like whenever we are making any analysis or whenever we are uh, doing a study of our own. This helps us to see and get a feel of a real market the way it replayed the way it happened very simple just click on this and after clicking on this you will be seeing a red line appearing on your screen from whichever time period you want to place it like say for example i'm seeing it in nifty and i want to place it from 14th may um you know like 10 25 a.m candle just i place it over there the moment i place it over there i will be able to see the all the bars which is in front of that time period will vanish will disappear and everything will start over here in the bo bottom small window I have to just click on this play button and it will start playing now if you want you can increase or decrease the speed choice is yours okay but this is going to give you a real life feel of what had happened in the market a very powerful tool for technical analysis so that's all friends that's all for today's session and um, in the next session what we will be doing is we will be covering more about the indicator based trading setup we will talk more about the drawing tool based trading we will talk about multi time frame trading and correlated trading i'm sure by now you have already created um, your trading view account along with the fires trading account um, if you have not done please click in the link in the description and go ahead with it for any queries or for any request if you have any request to code your own strategy please drop a mail to support at fires.in and we will be helping you to code your own trading strategy thank you so much friends be safe stay healthy happy learning and happy trading